no, like when I'm when I finish the sushi, I just drink the soy sauce. This week, we broke up. She said I wasn't boyfriend material. She's not wrong. Well, and how many boyfriends have you had, Stella? Don't worry, he'll have another girlfriend by tomorrow. I, uh, I got all nines in my GCSEs, so um, I'm going to fashion college. Oh my god, that's amazing, Flo. I've decided I'm going to take English and History for a I only got one nine in art, but that means I'm going to art college. And I failed everything, so I guess I'm not going to college. Oh, I'm sorry, Max. It's fine. I hate school anyway. I love that bag. How much is it? I'm afraid it's not for sale. Why? Somebody left it behind. Would you like to take a look at it? Would you like it? Oh, <laughs> yes, please. Please take it, it's yours. Thank you. Could someone leave such a bag? Completely forget about it. And it's filled with belongings. Maybe we can find the owner. How would we do that? Um, well, I don't know. Maybe if we looked inside? do you think that's a bit intrusive? Um... Okay, Florence, but how else would we find out? <sighs> Who cares? I'm... They've left it long enough. Just keep it. So. But it's such a beautiful bag. And I'm sure it has such precious things. They would want back. says it's from Arcadia. Arcadia? That's the most beautiful shop there is in Oxford, filled with such magical items. Well, let's and go. There's um, there's a note to Indigo. I know you'll love this. Maybe we will meet again someday, Jay. Who's Jay? Obviously the person who gave her the book. I bet it's from a secret lover, the sort of person who would sneak her books and attach love letters. They would read books together and meet here every day, reading extravagant love stories or dreaming up their own but they were torn apart because it was forbidden love. Indigo is from a rich family, but Jay is from a poor family and it could never work. Indigo lives in a world of books, her mind filled with magical scenarios where she was the princess and Jay was her knight in shining armor. This isn't a Jane Austen novel, but we do know her name now, Indigo. Why are we assuming it's a she? Because she has a handbag and lipstick. Men can have handbags and lipstick. Yeah, drag queens. Indigo could be a man's name. I Jay just... obviously wasn't going to see Indigo again. Yes, because it was forbidden. Guys, I don't think I see how any of this is going to help us find them. I think we might be wasting our time. Right, let's see this bag. Hmm. Oh, I know this exhibit. 
It's from the Ashmolean. Oh, I love the Ashmolean. Full of beautiful paintings and sculptures. It says, meet me at this exhibit, 2.30pm. J. J, again. I told you, Indigo has the secret lover. Come on then, let's go. Wow, yeah, okay, this, this is beautiful. It's literally just a horse, man. It's a centaur. I see why Jay picked here to meet. It's so quiet and still yet so full of life and dreams. You know, Stella, I think you're wrong about Jay. I think Jay was a friend, a, a completely platonic friend who wanted to inspire Indigo because Indigo is an artist, an artist always looking for creativity. You know, and, and maybe Jay was too. They would give her new ideas for taking her to different locations around the city, j just like this one. They would meet here and draw together anything that came to mind, just in absolute silence. They would show each other and swap papers and study each other's imagination and, and then talk in great detail about it. She spent every second she could studying art and just taking everything in. Wow, Jordan. You sound just like Stella. I can't wait to draw these later. Jordan's in his element. Look, there's a business card from Ballroom Emporium. What's that? Somewhere I like, finally. Let's go. Wait, there's so much to look at here. Oh my God. These dresses, they're, they're exquisite. I mean, oh, Indigo definitely has style. It looks like he's got the whole of the West End. It is so incredibly beautiful. How could Indigo afford to shop here? You know, I bet Indigo was like an upper class fashionista, a glamorous woman with style and flair. Well, she'd be invited to all sorts of prosperous events and dress like a Hollywood star in the red carpet. Jay was her assistant and, and they would follow her around helping her choose her attire for that evening. You know, she would visit this shop almost daily buying whatever took her fancy. And she'd meet Jay often to discuss her plans. You know, I think I imagine her as like an alluring, mysterious woman. God, you guys are so wrapped up in this. We need to be trying to find Indigo and return the bag to her. Ooh. She had style. Maybe she's not so boring. There's a note that says, meet me at 1am at St. Giles Cemetery and come away with me. Jay. A cemetery? Isn't that a bit creepy? Why would you want to meet there? Well, that's really late. Maybe Jay has a strange aesthetic. <laughs> there are a ton of notes in here and they're all from Jay. Isn't that a bit excessive? Intense. How cool is this? Very cool. Max practically lives there. I just don't understand why a sophisticated woman like Indigo would come here. Hey, this place is very sophisticated, clearly. But why that song? 
the name of the song is Come Away With Me. So maybe they were planning to run away together because of the forbidden love. Oh, and they were sneaking out to meet at 1am. Look, I really don't want to sound like Stella, but she does have a point. They were definitely in love. It's one of those things where you meet when you're young, and even then, you know you're going to get married one day. <sighs> they meet here and share their favourite music together because they both live for music. Indigo felt like Jay was the only person who really knew and understood her, and they had a dream to run away one day, somewhere far away, somewhere it could be just them. Indigo wanted a simple life, just a simple life with Jay. Well, look who's getting all wrapped up in this now. I guess this guy's secretly a player. Hey ladies, this fella's mm. looking for someone's hand to hold. Shut up. <laughs> he, he definitely has a song for each of his weekly girlfriends. <laughs> Let's go. There must be something in here that's useful to us. What are you waiting for? Call it. I'll talk. Hello? Hi. Is this Indigo? No, this is Violet. Who is this? Do you, do you know where we might find her? Indigo was murdered a few months ago. What do you want? We found her bag, a, a Prado bag. That is, that's key evidence that the police have been searching for. Uh, where was she last seen? She was found at the cemetery. We last seen with a stranger called James. Jay. Jay. I will collect the bag immediately. Where even is she? Alright, look. I don't want to get involved with the police. Can we just, like, leave it here and leg it? No, Max, Don't! I... Come on! 